Hi, my name is Rich from Phoenix, Arizona. Um, I'm a prior Marine. Um, I served from 2004 to 2009. Uh, I was a field radar operator. Um, and then I finished my career as an embassy guard. So I'd served uh, defending three U.S. embassies. I did not vote for Trump in 2016. Um, I did vote for Kasich in the, the primaries that year. Um, I I was turned off for him from the moment he got on stage for the first time. And, you know, he started saying he had all the answers. He started saying that he could solve all your problems. And by the way, they're not your fault. They're not. Your problems and your issues aren't your fault. They're the fault of fill in the blank, these Americans. And I saw that and I was disgusted by it, uh, watching him turn Americans on each other like that. But I think I was more disturbed by watching it work, watching people around me work, that message work on them. I was in Afghanistan in 2016 as a contractor um, during the election, and I uh, you know, I, they say that character is destiny, and I look around the country now and I, all I see is the consequences of his character. Anyone, literally anyone in the office right now would have done a better job with this virus because all they had to do was just put some effort in managing it, some effort. And they would have done way better, just a little bit of effort, just something, and they would have done way more than he did. Um, I... Uh, I'm fully supporting Joe Biden, fully supporting Joe Biden. And this is why you have to have a capable person in the white house. First and foremost, that's the first thing you, when you're voting, you need to put in the white house or in charge of anything. Can they do the job? Trump couldn't, he never could. He couldn't even manage his own companies. Why would he, you know, why would anyone think that he can manage a, a government? Uh, you know, everything else is secondary. You know, got to he's got to be able to do the job first, and uh, he's going to put people who are going to run their sectors, run their parts of the government with uh, as best as they can. You know, Trump was all about having people that looked up to him. That um. Character, again, character, right? Uh, Joe Biden might make some gaffes, but they're never with malice intent. Never goes out to hurt people or divide people. That's all Trump does. That's all he does all the time. And um, I've had enough. I can't. I can't. I can't even watch him or listen to him. And I certainly can't listen to his message, Trump's message anymore. Cause it's, it's just garbage.